Hey everyone, so I'm here to give you guys a What's in My Backpack video. It was requested. Um, well, I, I know that I mentioned that I wanted to do the back, the What's in My Backpack or the What's in My School Bag, um, but a, a people did request it. People did tell me um, what I needed to call it so that way people would find it more. So I'm going to be calling this What's in My School Bag. But um, first, I want to um, show you guys something that I forgot to show you. And like my last three videos, um, it was it's two items that I bought whenever um, whenever I was doing my first back to school haul. I ordered a Hollister hoodie, which I did mention in that video. I, I did mention that it would be coming in the mail, and I forgot to show you guys in my part two, and I forgot to show you guys in I forgot to add it to my um, what's in my uh, my school supplies haul. I forgot to add that in there. Um, I also got a shirt during my second part of my back to school haul and um well a little after that so I could have showed it to you guys in my last video but I forgot to do it then and yeah okay so I'm just gonna show you guys now um okay so here's the hoodie that I ordered from Hollister um it's a really pretty blue I got it on sale I got so lucky I got it on sale and it was let me see it was thirty nine fifty can you see that? And, um, I got it on sale for maybe $24, plus I had to pay shipping, so altogether I got it for about $31. So, also, I went to, um, the other item that I got was from Factory Connection. I had a pair of shorts that, uh, I hadn't wore that I had, like, from the beginning of the summer, and I still had the tag on it and everything, and I just, I didn't wear it. I didn't wear them. So I just took them back and I figured, hey, I can get something else cute for school. So I did. And I got this shirt. And I think it is just absolutely gorgeous. It's got, like, all these sparkles on it. Like, gold sparkles. And if you kind of look at it, it's in this vapor print, like, design. Can, can you guys see what I'm talking about? Just look at it closely, I guess. But it's one of those shirts with the sleeves with the hole in it. Like, this is the top that goes, like, on your shoulder. And then this is the part that lands onto your arm. So, here's the hole. That, like, it goes, like, the hole goes about, like, over right here. So, that part goes there. And then the other part goes there. And a lot of you guys probably have them. But, you know, I got this for $13.99. And it was by the uh, by Almost Famous. Okay. Might not know them yet. But they're almost fine. <laughs> but, but, yeah. Or, no. Um, I guess I'll just start on my, what's in my backpack. Um, so, here's my backpack, which I showed you guys in my part two haul. And it's just my yak pack that I ordered from Kohl's. And I got it on sale for $12.99. And, um, it was $55. So, it was a really good deal because it's an extremely good backpack. Like, it's, this is, it's, this isn't heavy, but I mean, it's a good amount of weight. And, I have a feeling that this is seriously going to hold up for a really long time. I'll just show you what's in this bottom pocket first. Okay, so, in the bottom pocket right here, this is all the room that's in it. I'll just show you guys in here. Okay, so... I have these Kleenex tissues that I found in my purse. I mean, I probably need to get a new pack of these, but I found these in my purse from last year that I hadn't cleaned out yet. And we got like a whole box of these or something last year, and my mom just gave me some, and I was like, ooh, clean it. Yeah. And then I have this Baby Lips chapstick. This is the best chapstick ever. And I just now found this in my purse from last year. Like, I knew I had a lot of stuff that I could put in my backpack this year. Because last year I went from a backpack to a purse to just a binder, and it's just a weird thing last year. And yeah, so I have this chapstick. It's the the peach. It's the peach. I don't know, but this is this, this chapstick is a bomb. Yeah, I don't really like how this how like the color looks whenever you put it on, but it feels good. So, I also have this little sparkly purple brush that I've had for years, like, probably since I was little. And, I mean, it works good. It's actually a really good brush for it to be so small, plus I have short hair, so, yeah. And, 
then I have this little Van Hansen visor. And the only reason I do not have this on, like, any of the little, like, um, straps or whatever that they are, is because I just, it just hangs so funny. And I don't really like having this hand sanitizer, like, out in the open because, like, even boys, they try to use this stuff. Like, boys don't even like. I'm like, what? I don't even like you. So, this is the Twilight Woods. It smells so good. Let's just smell it together. Everybody else. Yeah, smell in the woods at Twilight. Oh yeah. This is for this is for your girly utensils. Girly utensils. Yeah. It's a U by Kotex thing and it's just this little this little pouch. So like you know, your stuff isn't falling out everywhere in front of everybody because that's not good. Okay. So in this pocket, the little back pocket behind it. Um all I have, this is, this is like an overview of it, and all I have in here is my purple pen, my blue pen, and my green pen that I showed in my uh, school spot. So they're the, the Papermate ballpoint pens, and they work like heaven, okay? I already tried the purple one, and I find that, you know, I'll probably use these colors more than I'll use like the orange one that I don't have in here because these are just so bright. Very easy to see. You know what I'm saying? So I'll put them in here because there was only three holes in one. So then in this big pocket okay first thing I have is this is the notebook that I bought yesterday. Uh, well my sister bought it for me yesterday and it's, it was a 97 cent notebook from Walmart and I just didn't take this part off because I wanted, because I didn't show it in my school stuff all because I got it yesterday, and I didn't know I was, I, I didn't really know if I was going to use anything else, but I did need a notebook for the first day of school just to like carry it around, and uh, instead of carrying my backpack, and yeah, it's just the 97 notebook, 97 cent notebook, and it's purple and it's got like the plastic cover, and it's just really pretty and really nice, and the paper is really nice in it, like. I don't know. It's just really nice paper. Oh, and I have this little folder. Folder in the beginning of it. Oh, here's my schedule that I have to get changed. Yeah. Um. Next. These are just in here because I don't want to lose them. These are my school papers that I have to take back and get signed. It's not a whole lot, but I've already signed most of it. I just need to find the rest. Okay. Next, I have this. Five star notebook, the um, five subject notebook. I uh, probably use this for like English or something. But I had this last year and it was in pretty good condition. I barely even used it, so the papers that I did mark on, I just tore them out and I'm just gonna use it again this year because it like matches my backpack anyway. Got it? Yep. A little bit. And next, I have my homework folder, and this is the Studio C and. Next, I have one of my durable binders. Okay, so this is the inside of my binder. This is what this is what every one of my binders look on, look like on the inside. Just a ton of paper because I got an extra pack of paper yesterday, and then just my dividers. So that's what they look like. And then, yeah, I haven't decorated it yet, and I still have this little paper in it because I don't know why. Here's the um, turquoise binder that I have, and there's the overview of this one. Yeah, same thing. And the blue binder. This is not a durable binder. I got this from Magic Mart. It's, I don't know. It's a view binder. That might be the brand. But, yeah. Here's the inside of that one. Here we it. These are, oh, these are the old, um, dividers that I said I used last year. They're, like, like bent and stuff. But I'll probably use this binder less than those two because it's not as durable. Okay, the last thing I have in my pack is the pencil pouch that my sister got me yesterday. She went to church yesterday, and they were giving away school supplies, and she had a pencil pouch, and I didn't have a pencil pouch, and I realized that just putting, like, my pencils, all the pencils that I have and everything inside one of these little pockets was just not cutting it. Like, I was afraid that I would break all my pencils, because I have so many of those big pencils, and I was afraid that I would break them. So, yeah, okay, so on this first pouch, um, I have 
the orange pin. Um, I have two things of lead. This one um, came with my paper rack pencils, and this my sister gave me this. That she got this from Food City. She got like a pack with two in it. Um, and then I have my two paper make pencils that my sister got me yesterday. And I think if this comes with extra erasers, I'm pretty sure I throw the erasers away. And we already took the garbage out, I'm pretty sure. So that just sucks. But, I mean, if if you can buy, like, um, extra erasers <laughs> for these things, um, without getting a whole pack of pencils, somebody tell me. Like, if you know any erasers that will, um, fit, like, into these paper make pencils, then let me know because I'll probably be running out of the eraser before the lead itself. So yeah, I have those. Um, next in this big pocket, I just have, well, there went one. <laughs> Running away from me. I have one of my big pencils. I think I just broke one. I don't know, but also I have this Sharpie highlighter that I just used last year, and I only have one because I don't really use highlighters um, so much. Like last year, I just used this highlighter whenever we did um, word searches in my U.S. History class, which we never even turned in, so I didn't know what the point was, but I don't really use highlighters, and if I ever needed them in that class, then I would just ask my teacher if I could borrow one of his because he had like pink and stuff, but yeah, these, um, the white ones are the .9 lead, and... The black ones are the point seven lead. I need to get a pack of like the point point nine lead because both of the ones that I have are point seven. Um, that's it for my what's in the backpack video. Um, keep making requests, you guys. I really love them. Um, I had someone request me to do a boyfriend tag. If you guys would like to see, if you guys would also like to see that, let me know because, um, let me know by this weekend because, um, my boyfriend may be coming up, maybe, but I'll try to, like, if you want me to do, like, a video like that, I'll do it as soon as possible. Um, I don't think there's anything else. Oh, somebody also requested that I would do, um, a how to style your vans video um if you guys want me to do that just request it and because I'm not really sure how many people would watch that I mean it's a fashion video so I'm sure like a lot of girls might watch that but I mean I don't know um because I'm new with this like I said probably in my last video but um just let me know and I'll get on that because I'm actually really excited to do that so Make more requests for my back to school series. I will do them because I kind of need a little help. Um, yeah, next video probably coming up will probably be um, how to style your vans if you're that. So I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.